Good morning. Good morning, guys. I hope everyone is doing well and happy. I'm actually, I think I'm going to do a live for Facebook, <clears throat> excuse me, because I've, I've kind of been going through my uh, cabinet here and uh, kind of reworking my herbs and things like that. So I might just do a live Facebook. But what I wanted to share with you is... Um, some of the things that I've that's been going on here, um, I actually went thrifting again. Oh my goodness, again <laughs> yesterday, and I did find a fabric for my shelves. But I wanted to kind of want to share with you my shelves and the condition that they were there are in. It's just horrible. So you know, yes, I'm just one of those people. I just can't seem to sit still. So <laughs> so um, I'm really not quite sure if I can turn this around. I'm so bad at this live stuff, but I wanted to just kind of pan you over here and show you my shelves here. I think you can see how really awful they are. Now the top one is not too bad. There's my little Fay. The top one's not too bad, but this one I painted and yikes, the bottom one is going to basically stay just like it is because it's, that's not a worry. But um, yeah, I've got a little bit of a spell candle happening here. And uh, I hope everyone's doing well. Uh, but what I've got going here, and I, I like I said, I, I kind of went through my entire cabinet here and kind of... I've been reworking it a little bit, and what I've wound up with is a lot of empty bottles, a lot of herbs that need to be worked on. But what I wanted to share with you is kind of the mini haul, and, and again, I'm, I'm going to try to turn this around. Not really sure what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. But anyway, I did find... Now, I know I shared with you guys this little bit of artwork right here that a subscriber sent me. And it's actually just inspired me so much because I just love it. And I have a very big, I mean, I'm talking probably 15, 20 feet tall uh, mountain laurel that is just completely gone, you know. And so what I'm going to do is when I get a chance, I'm going to cut it down and I'm going to use it kind of like it is here, not on the house, but like for a railing and stuff. And I'm getting ready to make uh, some bath salts. And, you know, you might be saying, well, why is powdered milk here? Well, powder, I add, sometimes I add a little bit of powdered milk into my bath salts. But what I found down here, really what I've got to do, I'm going to just kneel down a little bit is, oh my goodness, I found some of these little, little things, <laughs> succulent things at Dollar Tree. And I found this cute little thing. I have no idea why I bought it, it other than it was cute. And a nifty pair of scissors. You always n need a nifty pair of scissors. And these are Rebel and Transfers. So, I don't know. I kind of like the colors. And I, I mean, it's a dollar. Some fabric liquid mini stitch. And another crafter square, except this one's round. <laughs> I had to have it. It was the last one. So, yeah, it's basically numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven ish or so. And I found, now I have a large version of this, but it's for a book, and I can't get it out with, and I found that thrifting. And I did buy some, since I'm going to be doing, and I've decided I'm going to do the uh, shelves I'm thinking today, not quite sure, but this is a spray clear acrylic sealer and you know how they have um 
like peanut butter and jelly socks. Well, this must be Dollar Tree's uh, <laughs> equivalent because this is waffles, <laughs> chicken, fried chicken and waffles. <laughs> oh my gosh. So yes, of course I had to buy these. But the fabric that I found, oops, sorry guys, the fabric that I found, and again, I was going to go and like to a big box store and I said, you know, no, <laughs> I just, I just driving into Nashville, into a big city like that, I'm like, yeah, I don't think so. So I did go thrifting though, and I did find a fabric that I really, really like, and I think it's going to be enough for the shelves. Hi! <laughs> and um, so this is what I found. I think I can. This is what I found. And I really just love the colors in it. And I also bought, these were reduced. <laughs> and I'm thinking that I'm going to have to edge whatever. If I tuck it under, I'm going to edge it and make it look, even though it's underneath, I'm going to make it look really, really good. And I found another book. And I don't even know the title to it. It's just very old. And let's see if we can. And again, it's a, another one of these library books. It's Miss Spider's Wedding. And yeah, I think you guys can see. But uh, it just looked like one of those weird, even though it's an older, older book, it's kind of unusual. It's got a little bit of extra love here. <laughs> But, um, yeah, so there you go. Um, like I said, I think I'm going to go and do a bit of a live on Facebook and kind of take a few people through my herb cabinet and uh, name basically the one herb that I probably couldn't live without. And I guess it's kind of dependent on what your practice is and what you do you know, what you do, what you do you, but I'm, you know, you see a few bins here and things like that, and yeah, I bought these <laughs> at Thrift too, but I'm, I'm really just getting ready to kind of, you know, pack things up that I'm not really using very, very much, and uh, kind of moving forward a little bit, but um, I hope you guys have a great day. I want to thank you so much for joining me, and I'm going to try to do a live, like I said, on Facebook. I'm not, I'm just not really good at this. So, but you know, thank you. It's just so great to see everyone. And I will talk to you guys later.